Hey, what's up, guys? It's Brennan here with Balasong Flipping. Hopefully, everybody is enjoying their day. It's a Friday. It's a beautiful day. Anyway, I wanted to talk about Balasong's uncomfortability and favoritism. You know, in the very beginning, I was trying to exactly figure out what makes a Balasong more favored. In terms of your own preference, not in a group setting, not in the majority. But just to you, what makes a Balasong more favorite to, like, other than other Balasongs? So, here's the way that I'm breaking this down, because I think I figured it out. Um, as you saw the other day, just yesterday, I received a Squid Trainer and the Serum Velocity Decode, which is one of the best flippers, even better than the Squid Trainer. Um, and so why do I still like flipping the BB Firefly, and why is it still one of my favorites? Um, especially this one. So, I think I figured it out. When a Balasong can have good performance and is really fun, and is comfortable, I think that's what ultimately makes something the most favorite out of a bunch. Because I thought, wait, I thought, is it the look? And although I think this looks amazing, I don't think it's the look. Um, and then I was thinking, is it the sound? And I was like, well, hold on a second. The tang pin one does sound a little bit um, glassier or nice, marblier than this sound. So I was like, okay, it's not the sound. It's not the look. It's the feel. Which is a huge comfortability factor. It all comes down to the feel. And that's whether it's heavy, light, smooth, coarse. Um, and it's all going to be based on preference in that in those departments but for me specifically this ballast song is so much fun and can perform very well but is also extremely comfortable this ballast song is very nicely rounded and smooth and even those milling marks they're honestly only there to help with the grip they're not that you don't even feel them as a discomfort they're literally just there to assist you flipping. So that's why I think this is a really nice design by uh, BB Barfly. And I really do love their company. But yeah, that's just something I thought that I would mention. Is I believe that favoritism in ballast songs comes down to the feel. Um, obviously the fun and performance. But the feel is like the cherry on top for how someone makes a decision for their favorite. And let me know if I'm wrong in the comments. Let me know if you guys would rather, you know, the worst performing non-fun ballast song, but sounds like a perfect, you know, whatever it is to you that it sounds like, or, um, what were the other ones? Oh yeah, the look. Something that just looks so spectacular, yet it doesn't have the sound, or it just looks and has the sound, but doesn't flip very well. Like, let me know what you guys think. But I think for me... Um, having comfortability in a trainer, uh, especially one that you're going to be flipping all of the time is extremely important. And I think that BB Barfly has knocked it out of the park, which is why I love their products the most. Um, I think that it's my favorite ballast song, this one here. So yeah, anyway. I will be seeing you guys in the next videos. Hopefully everyone's doing good, as I said when I started the video. And, uh, yeah. Yeet.